guys, welcome back. So this morning I'm just gonna do a little fast, like summer, no makeup, makeup look. Just kind of my like go-to where I just like throw everything on. I do just very minimal amounts of makeup. I don't really like to wear a lot of makeup unless I'm really like going out and like, you know, needing to look like spot on. Um, I do have some acne scarring issues on my face a little bit but um, that I, you know, cover up just a little bit. But honestly, they're not that bad anymore. You know, I've learned to really like take care of my skin and really clean it. And um, I do exfoliate and, you know, different things for it at times. I have been doing a little bit of derma rolling. I've been trying to get into that more, just just a little, just to try to go around like, you know, the, the acne prone like areas that I get right through here, just to try to clear it up and you know just have like a fresher brighter skin like we all want to do so i'll link all of the products that i use down below i'm not going to go into like you know showing the type that i use right now on this one and you know like um breaking down each product but i will link every single one of them below so that way you know if you happen to like something that i'm using it's super easy to grab but first gotta have a little bit of coffee coffee absolutely is like my go-to i know some people like tea some people don't like any of it it's fine Coffee is like my go-to, it touches my soul, it's amazing, and I just need a little bit of it. Plus, I love my queen cup that I have. So when I first like, got out of the shower, I did put on, I use a vitamin C serum, just like a couple drops, and just put a little bit on my face and let it dry really well. And I do have a mirror down below me, like right here to be able to see what I'm doing. So if I'm not looking straight at you, that's why. I know this is going to draw some people absolutely insane and that's fine. <laughs> um, I use my fingers to put on my concealer, BB cream, anything like that. I have the brushes, I've bought all the things because you know, I've watched all the videos. This is what you need to do. This is the better way of doing it. But for me, honestly, doing it with my fingers, I just feel more comfortable with it and I feel like I can get into it more. And um, it's just my thing, what I like to use. I just like take like one little drip, one little drop of concealer and I just pat that in. Since I usually do this in the bathroom, I wash my hands right afterwards to get all the makeup off my fingers. But this time I just have a little towel to be able to wipe it off with. One trick that I found is I like to put a little bit of powder on like my eyelids before. I've been using a stick um, eyeshadow. And so I like to put that on just a little bit before that way, cause the powder, it makes like the um, eyeshadow stick more, the liquid eyeshadow type. It makes it stick better where it doesn't like wear off during the day. Yes, like that. I'm just gonna leave it that way all day. <laughs> no. Then I just take my finger and just lightly blend it. Now I just take my powder. And honestly, like that part is basically it for my whole face. I do my eyes a little bit more, but not much. Um, I don't know if anyone else has an obsession with chapstick. I definitely do. I have probably, I don't know, I would say five or six tubes of chapstick, maybe more at times. And it's not a like specific brand or anything, just different ones um, that I have tried, that I like, that I didn't like, that's laying around. 
I'm gonna grab it and put it on basically no matter what it is unless it has like a color to it. I found that I'm not really big into like the the color chapstick. If it has like a little bit of like sheer tint to it then I like that. You know maybe in the winter time a little bit more of a different like mauve color or something but for the most part I just like a good like moisturizing chapstick. In the summer I do use mostly um a chapstick that has SPF in it just a little bit just to keep you know my lips from getting burned because I'm out in the sun a lot in the summertime but other than that and again not really a specific brand um, I do have one favorite chapstick that I love that I will link below just in case anyone wants to try it out but I don't have any like specific ones that I'm like oh my god this is like my must have oh and a little trick that I found you don't have to spend like a lot of money on a little eyebrow brush. I don't use anything on it. And to be completely honest, I've bought them before years ago. Like, you know, the special ones, you know, to like really shape your eyebrows and give it, no. What I found for me, for me, that I really like is I will use my mascara, my favorite mascara, whatever. When that mascara runs out, I clean that brush really, really well get all the makeup off of it, all the mascara off of it, clean it, soak it, clean it again, then I just keep the brush. It's a great little hack there. So I just take my eyebrows, just kind of brush them up a little. That's it for that. In the summertime, I don't really use a lot of, well, honestly, I just don't use a lot of makeup anymore. I mean, when I was younger, I used to use a lot of makeup. Like, I'm like, oh, my no makeup look is like 12 steps. <laughs> it's very simple now. I try to keep it just as simple and just as minimum as possible. I have figured out in my life that I'm really loving the like, minimalist 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 life I guess that's the best way to say it like that is like that just makes it so much hap makes me so much happier it just makes it so much easier for me I don't know I just like it I will say and I know this is not gonna be one that I'm like I know I said I wasn't gonna like show makeup or show anything like that but for me, this is always my go-to mascara. I try all these different expensive mascaras. I go back to this one every single time. I will put the link. I will link it down below just so you can find it. I always get it on Amazon. But I will link it below. It's just one of those. I'm sure everyone has that like, oh, you know, I've had different ones. This is like my go-to. I've tried the expensive ones. I've tried the real cheap ones. I think that this one is like nine, 10 bucks and it lasts me forever. And I use it every single day. Even if I don't wear any makeup at all and I put on a little bit of like a moisturizer with some SPF in it, I still put this on. Well, I should say that I don't put, I put it on every day, but if I'm at home and I'm not going anywhere, I'm not putting anything on my face. Does everyone else make those crazy faces when you're doing it? <laughs> you have to get in there. <laughs> Don't judge. <laughs> I actually love to watch people put makeup on because I like to see how everyone does it so differently. Like some people go like, you know, eye, they do the one whole eye and then they go to the next eye. For some reason, I've always went to my top one my other top one, and then my bottom ones. I'm not really sure why I do that, but I've just kind of always done that. And it's one of those things, like if you, you know, like right left-handed your whole life or your right hand and then you switch hands, it just seems so wrong whenever you do it. That's how I feel about my eyes. Now, I do put mascara on my bottom lids, but, cause I know, you know there's some people who are like, oh, I would never put mascara on my bottom lids. I always have, but the way I do it is I always like, you know, use like all of the mascara that, not all of it, but a lot of the mascara that's on the brush for my top ones. And I go over them a few times just to fill in anything that didn't grab. I have pretty long eyelashes, but my eyelashes are blonde because my hair is blonde. Well, obviously I get my hair colored, 
but my hair is like a dirty blonde color, so my eyelashes are almost the same exact color. So I do um, put on mascara, you know, to kind of like emphasize the length of them and everything, but they are pretty long. Here's where the crazy face comes in. <laughs> I don't put a lot on the bottoms, just a little. Okay, so that is pretty much it on my just get ready. If I would have done that in a like, you know, fast pace and not stopped and talk and had some coffee and everything, honestly, it takes me like three minutes to like throw on that like little fast makeup, no makeup look. It's super easy. And honestly, it's not heavy, it feels really good, and it just gives you enough of like look to where you feel comfortable, where you feel, you know, like, girl's got it today, mm -mm -mm. but it still is not heavy and it's not terrible for the summer. And because I'm gonna be honest, I hate, like, I live in Georgia, it's hot in the summer, it's humid in the summer. And I hate going outside, you know, you put on like a full face of makeup looking, looking spot on. And you go outside and it's like, <laughs> melts it off. And I don't know, I've tried a few of the different, you know, like creams where you put on before that's supposed to like, you know, really like hold that makeup on. I've bought makeup that, you know, is supposed to like really stay. I've bought expensive makeup that's supposed to really stay. I bought cheap makeup that's supposed to really stay. And... For me, well, I guess for me, I have really oily skin, especially like in all of my like T areas, super oily skin. Within about 30 minutes, I'm already going to have like little shines right here. I've just learned to embrace it because I've tried everything and I'm just like, mm, I'll just blot it at some point today and just keep going. I'm, I don't even care. But I hate when you put on like so much makeup and you're looking fly, you're looking good, girl. You know what I'm talking about. And then you walk outside and by the time you get to where you're going, your makeup is already feels like it's running, it's sticky, it's just not. So that's just why I don't put on a lot of makeup anymore. So here we are. Here's today's look. Well, so far I've not gotten ready yet, but still in my pajamas. This is today's look. Love you guys, hope you enjoyed. And remember everything that I did use on my makeup today, I will link below so that way you can check it out. If there's anything you know that you might be interested in or just any of the looks or if you have any questions just don't forget to comment below thanks guys and don't forget smash that like button subscribe if you liked it and you want to see more videos bye